This is the time when the talking has to stop and the action finally begins. A warm welcome to Wembley from me, Derek Ray. I'm joined in the commentary box by Stuart Robson, and we're just seconds away from kickoff time in what promises to be a wonderful Carabao Cup final. It is Manchester United up against Newcastle United. What a chance for one of these teams to get their hands on silverware. And over the years, we've seen some great League Cup finals. Let's hope today matches up to some of those occasions. Really looking forward to this one, Derek. Number eight, Bruno Fernandes. And number 25, Jadon Sancho. And here's the lineup for Manchester United. David De Gea stands between the posts. Marcel Zabitza plays with Casemiro in the center of the pitch. And the idea is to have just the one striker up there trying to pose problems for the opposition. So the starting 11 for Newcastle United. Well, the two wide players are great in 1v1 situations and their movement is also very good. But it's the midfield three that will need to control the flow of the game. So the battle commences. Willock. Bachmann. Sam Maxima. Joe Willock. The cross is on. And that came off the defender, so it'll be a corner. Who's going to get on the end of it? Well, they had a decent reading of that ball in. Diogo Dallo. Excellent vision. Might be able to get in behind the defence. Bruno Fernandes. Newcastle regaining possession here. Gordon Marcel Zabitza Bruno Fernandes has it he's very adept at protecting the ball a good and fair challenge Isaac That's what you call defending from the front. Possibilities here. Rashford. Beghorst. No possibilities in the centre. Plays it back. Trying to chisel a chance out of it. And a goal! Well, let's look at this again. He's done superbly well to pick out a teammate here, and he makes the finish look so easy. What a good goal that is. Go for the 
And Newcastle get the ball rolling once more. How will they react to this setback? Trippier. Joe Willock. Just looking for the right moment for that final pass. Isaac. San Maxima. Well clattered away. Well, there it is. United haven't had as much of the ball, but when they have won it back in midfield areas, their counter-attacking has been excellent. They'll be happy with the way the game's going at the moment. Marcel Zabitza and Rashford. Veghorst won it back. Gordon. Isaac. And the Magpies moving the ball forward with purpose. But it fizzles out thanks to that piece of defending. So nearing the break, and it's United on top. Stuart, how about your critique of their first half display? Well, they've worked hard and played well to be in front here, but they now need to keep their focus as we approach half time. Rashford. Well, there's a textbook example of how to press the ball. And one minute of stoppage time has been added on. Physically strong and secure on the ball. The first half here comes to an end. And so the battle commences. Plays it back. Trying to chisel a chance out of it. And a goal for United! The opener in the final. And it could be hugely significant. Second half underway with United looking to build upon a largely positive first half showing. Well, possession is the watchword inside their own territory. Casemiro. The ball with Zabitza. Rafael Varan. Marcel Zabitza. Now with Rashford. Casemiro. Decent position this for United to find themselves in. Accurate pass upon accurate pass. Sends it back. He might yet finish. And a textbook interception. And back with Gordon. Willock. Sam Maxima has it. They do pass the ball with authority. Fraser. Sam Maxima. Oh, terrific save. Well, you're absolutely right. That's a top class save. Just look how he reacts. Here's a change for Manchester United. Number 15, Marcel Sabitzer, to be replaced by 
Can someone get on the end of this? Still not clear. Wilson. He made it look simple, really. Read it magnificently and intercepted. Very quick thinking there. Veghorst, Malassia, United might be able to cash in. And credit is due for that good piece of defending. And they know they need to stop him. Space and time for the cross. And Gordon now. Saint Maxima. Oh, a goal! He's equalised! Was he made for moments like this? On an occasion like this? Well, this is a brilliant strike, as you can see. He hits it with so much power, the keeper had no chance. Fantastic finish. Away again here on the back of that leveler. Marcus Rashford. Sancho. On to Bruno Fernandes. Rashford. He's very adept at protecting the ball. Just look at the celebrations here. Well, as you can see, he gets a touch on this, but it's not quite enough to stop the goal. It was a good effort, though. in the dying embers will it prove decisive here Marcus Rashford slipshod passing on the attack in the closing phase Gordon Fraser goalkeeper getting in the way superb save well, this late corner could represent their last chance to equalise. And United will switch things around personnel-wise. Let's see about the delivery. You can't really head them any better than that. But the goalkeeper was up to the task. Five minutes left. Well, there was the chance for the equaliser. But you have to say, what a great save that was. Into the advanced position. Anthony Martial. This might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. Well, we are going to have a decent amount of stoppage time. Three minutes to be exact. Ryan Fraser. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Marcus Rashford. A running room in the wide position. This could be defending of the highest order 
And there goes the final whistle. The cup issue is settled. A story of one side celebrating and the other distraught. Memories are being made. Well, just look at those scenes down there, Derek. What a contrast in emotions. Brilliant for the winners, despair for the losers. But overall, the right team won today. Yeah, you can see what it means to this tight-knit team. Real solidarity. Well, this is special for everybody at the club. What a great moment for any young player. And this is what you dream about when you start playing football. When you're playing in the playground, you want to win a cup. Brilliant moment. Yes, a special moment in the career of any footballer. And now for the trophy lift itself. The cup winners. Well, you can just see what it means to those players and the manager. That's fantastic stuff. There's always the element of chance in a cup competition. But my goodness, they've taken the rough with the smooth. And now they savour the moment. Four marks to the entire team. And now they get the chance to exhale and enjoy. They've been brilliant in this competition, and so have the fans. They've really got behind their team. They've played a big part in this win. Just look at those faces in the crowd. Great stuff. They're really a match made in heaven between players and fans. And these celebrations are going to continue for quite some time. Now the players get to relax a bit and enjoy having the pictures taken. Well, these photos will be cherished for years to come, won't they? Certainly ones to show the grandchildren.